You know the drill, fams and famettes. Okay, okay, so here. I've got a box. And in this box I expect to find trading card game stuffs. Hopefully. Ooh, yes I do. And it is one of the it is a mega tin. Which means it's gonna have more stuff in it than a regular tin. <clears throat> And if you can hear that beautiful rattle, you know it's not just going to be packed on this thing. And this was the 17 mega tier at last year's. Look at that. Ah, shiny and beautiful. Which means there might be 2017 stuff in here. And I'm just going to show you. Look at this, it's so full. Ooh, let's grab a pile, shall we? <coughs> we have. Uh, uh, rupees? <laughs> one, two, <laughs> one, two, three, four, five of them to be precise. Toon Lane, Gorgon's Eye, Island Turtle, Stone Tattoo, and a Vampire Lady, yay. And then in the last video, on the last series, uh, we have Scum Invitation from Ferris 7, uh, first rare. Turn of Tempest, Hero, Hi Hero's Shadow Scout, Great White, and Ooh -hoo 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 -hoo! I don't know what the set is, but that is an Armital the Chaos Phantom. Now that is very nice. Let me see if I can get you guys a good view of that. That is pretty damn nice. Uh, Black Pendant and oh, Gozuki! And that's some DUSA. I don't know what DUSA is as a set, but we have Gozuki, which is a really good card for zombies. We have a Doom Caliber Knight. Which again is a fiend, but it is a really good card actually, it's a really good generic. This must have been, this was somebody's deck because there's another vampire lady here, and a vampire lord, and robin goblin, success probability 0%, DD borderline, Ryu Koki, 7 tools, another vampire lord, and another vampire lady, so this person must have had a vampire deck. Uh, grave robber's retribution, oh, let me try and get a better shot, there we go. Uh, Souls All in Bone Tower, Poison Mummy, Dark Death Spirit, Call of Mummy, Mystical Elf, 13th Grave, Pyramid Turtle, No One of Extermination, and Grave Digger, Grave Digger Ghoul from, that's a rare from Legend of Blue Eyes. So that's an original rare. It's not first edition, sadly, but eh, it's English edition, so it won't be first edition, obviously. Uh, Dark Assailants, two of them. Castle Dark Illusions, I remember watching that in the anime. And another great, two more copies of Grave Digger Ghoul. Maybe this person was making a theme deck, because I've seen Grave Digger Retribution as well. So this person might have had like a themed deck. Um, they have Book of Life for Zombies, two Royal Keepers, another Call of Mummy, Disappear, Chop Man the Desperate Outlaw, another DD Borderline. Yay! A Notorious Strawberry. It's not particularly rare, but Strawberry is one of the better Notorious. Let me explain what it does. Once per turn, when your opponent null summons a special of the monster, target one of those monsters, this card gains 100 attack times its level until the end phase. So if your opponent is, say, running a... Uh, gimmick puppets, for example, that gains 800 attack. Meaning, it goes from being, say, 1-6 to 2,400. On a level 4. Also, it's a freaking strawberry. And another one I'm really excited for, Arcana Force, um, I think that's 14, Temperance, which is a card I was actually looking for. And that's from Battle Pack 1 as well. Uh, when the turn, you can start the card in Battle. During the players, during time of the calculation, you need to play the turn, you discard this card, you take down no battle damage from that battle, which is really useful because it has hand trap capabilities as well. When this card is summoned, toss a coin and play its effect. This effect lasts for the first phase of the field. Heads, horrible damage, battle damage you take. Tails, horrible battle damage your opponent takes. So you really want heads for this. But let's be honest, half all battle damage you take. Like, that's good. And let's battle pack one. Battle pack one as well? Yeah. There's a lot of battle pack one stuff here, actually. Which is good for me, because I have battle pack one as a set. Uh, we have Raikou, Ry Life's One Hunter. And uh, number 39, Utopia. It's good, because it's an XYZ. Uh, Goblin Bird. 
and Skull Knight. Tainted Wisdom, Tainta, and Pachi. Will Eternal Rest from Dark Crisis. Set stuff. Um, Final Ritual of the Eight Hunts. Nekamane King, Kirkwood Jar, Gigantis, Giant Rat, Tribute to the Doomed, and all good kind of today. Sonic Jammer, Lost the Dragon, Trap Master, Compulse, that's a good generic. Uh, Rerun. Ooh! So this is, I don't know, this must be from the deck, but I believe. So this must be Spanish. This is a Spanish mammoth graveyard called Quimitia de Mammoth. Which I believe is Spanish. So that's interesting. Uh, reinforcements, Curse of Dragon, Molten Destruction, Hand in the Penthes, Book of Secret Arts, Autonomous Action Unit from Battle Pack 1, and Fabled Raven, uh, Dust Tornado, Sandstone, Sangan, Vile Germs, Reinforcements again, and Valkyrie, Destroyer Golden, and oh! I should probably put this on the bed, actually. And from Legend of Blue Eyes, we have a rare Spirit of the Harp. So another Legend of Blue Eyes rare. This person must have bought some Legend of Blue Eyes decks. This pack's even, which means maybe, they, maybe there's a Blue Eyes in here. Maybe there's an original Legend of Blue Eyes in here. Uh, we have another Irby. We have Card Guard from Battle Pack 1 and Fiendish Chain. Um, Where's that with junk? Is it there? Yes. Also there. Um, so card guard, finish. We have Chaos Necromancer, Hedge Guard, Offering to the Doomed, Mooka Mooka, Exile on Universe, Magic Training, Goblin Attack Force, Big Bang Shot, Stealth Bird, Skilled White Magician, Auntie, Shield Warrior, Mad Dog of Darkness, Great Protector, Zombie of the Dark, Liberty at Last. All these, g I can actually make Valpine Winners to set, geez. This to like, be like half completed. Uh, Drooling Wizard, Sword of Dark Destruction, Manny to Bug, Dark Hole, look at generic. And Magician's Rod from the Dark Illusion, that's not the special edition, that's the proper edition. So that's a super rare. Uh, Salt Mode Activate, Twin Sword Marauder, Submarine Frog, Flip Flip Frog. That's a rare arcane. Apprentice from Crimson Crisis, because everyone runs assault modes for some reason. I'm joking, of course. Um, Ebon Arrow, Assault Merc, Metaphysical Regeneration, Assault Slash, uh, Ivy Shackles, Telekinetic Power Well, and another rare from Crimson Crisis, which is Glad It Be Sam Knight. So, Glad It Be Staffs, yay. And for Seven again, Assault Merc again, Deep Frog. Ebon Arrow, Trap Eater, Mortrony Mixed Up, Soup Soul Nutrient Half on Nothing, Nightmare Arch Fiends, <laughs> actually quite a good card for um, Fusions because there's no Evil Thorn, and we have another rare which is Brain Golem from Raging Battle, that's nice. Effects of face up my monsters are negated. If this card destroys a little monster, probably can destroy it once again in a row. In a row. So if your opponent controls on light monsters, or you're running DNA surgery. Yeah. Would that negate its own effect, though? If it became a light monster, would that negate its own effect? To negate its own effect. Because if it's negating its effect, the effects the negates if it's a light monster. So its effect is simultaneously negated and not negated at the same time. Uh, Rose Tentacles, Crimson Fire, Junk Box, Gadget Arms, Sand Moth. Which is a real Schrodinger's cat, isn't it? Or rather Schrodinger's yu gi Which happens a lot. And we look like we're going into the structure next stuff. So we have Dark Magicians, nice. And another Magician's Rod, three of two of them to be exact. And this person must have made a new Magician's deck at some point. And I keep the Dark Magicians aside, because reasons. Symbol of Heritage, Neo Bubble Man, Photon Generating Unit, uh, Parasite Dicky, and C3 Reading End, lol. Yeah. 
The Neo Golden Man looks really cool though. Ancient Gear, Greater Shin, back to Chicky again. Ooh, Copper Face. Good for um, my Arcana Force deck. Spear Kraken, Zen Gambler, and a Wind Up Zen Maester from Battle Pack 1. Nice. And not a rare card to kill for that set, but it is an XYZ. That's two XYZs we've got so far. Uh, Exiled Force. Graveler and Found it Guarding Curse of Royal Rare. That's nice. Uh, Alien Grey, Pot of Greed, lol, what does it do? <clears throat> Mark in a Fortress. And that is a rare from Malpat 1. I now figured out that the rares have a slight indent on the text. So if I could put that up real close. You might not be able to see it at all, but it has an indent on the text. We have Drill Raid, nice. And Spell Shield Pipe 8. And Vortex Trooper. And another Utopia, that's nice. So I'm gonna put that as a generic slot at this point because we have one already in that brat one set. Uh, Shield Crush, DD Assailant. Both from the same set. This person wants to have like an entire boost box of Battle Pat 1, I swear. Or Dinner Draft. That's the Wolf Myler's Fire Yoru Yamu. Oh, look, Mad Reloader, another half or nothing. Giant Soldier Stone, Zero Priest, Devil Lightning, another Anti Killing Ant, Forest, Face Insect Hunter Spider, Flame Dancer, Legendary Sword, Mystical Ship, Time Wizard. Put that with the stuff I need for things. Koji Koshi, Blur, Koji Koshi, uh, Woods, Kirama, Koji Koshi again, Love Dark World Thorns, and the Later from Battle Pack 1. <coughs> Speed Roy Terror Top and t Double Yo Yo, that's nice. Those are good. Oh, heck. <coughs> it's always good to get Terror Tops. Terror Tops are actually really useful because I haven't been banned yet. Uh, PN Isimo. Oh, this is all Star Pack 17 stuff. We have a Star Fall, Crystal Rose. Look at its shininess! So there we send my Ogre Shoken Doji. <clears throat> Odd Eyes Lightning number 2. So, um, we have Buster Blade of the Dragon Destroyer Swordsman. That's a good card to get. And that's actually from the structure deck. Oh, I didn't know that. Magic Cylinder. Oh, heck. Oh heck, it's all coming to heck now. Yeah. Soul Rope or Hope on a Rope. Rock Bombardment. And Arcana Note Joker. Oh, that's all the Yuki Psycho Deck stuff, I guess. Dark Paladin, nice. Uh. <clears throat> Chimera and the Flying Mythical Beast. Another Buster Blader. And. Imperion Magnum, the Super Connected Beast. I'm guessing that's the Magnum Wire ones, yes. So that's nice. Ultra rare, even though it's technically from Structure Deck, I don't care. Another Garkana Knight and another Chimera. And another Ultra Rare, which is Berserk on the Electromagnar Warrior, so that's probably part of the fusion. And Valkyrie on the Magnum Warrior. Sword and Sealing, Magnet Conversion, Kribo! Mystic Box, Alpha, Sword Ring Light, so that's good. Kariborn, let me just read this. At the end of the battle phase, you can discard this card into whole monster in the graveyard, destroy a battle at the center, and summon a special summon it. When opponents monster cards and attack, you can banish this card from the graveyard and target any number of Kariborn. Kariborn special summon them. Yeah, because Kariborn was like apparently a really good card for the time. And I guess for Kariborn in particular, uh, we have Twin Headed Behemoth, Magnetic Field, the Sorcerer, Stick Stuff. Beta, Spell Shrouding Arrow, really good card to get. I remember when Spell Shrouding Arrow was quite expensive. Uh, Giant Soldier of Stone, Berthamet, Gazelle, obviously, Obnoxious Celtic Guard, Defusion, King's Knight, Gamma, Mirror Force, uh, good card to get, another good generic. Uh, Magic Cylinder again, Magician Circle, Polly, yay! Got Bombardment, Hope on a Rope and Attack the Moon. 
and there's still more. We have Gamma, Alpha, and Beta, the Electromagnetic Warriors, and here are the other ones, all super rares from that structure deck. That's one less structure deck I have to buy. When you think about it, if you were only after those particular cards for the rarity, that's eight pound less you'd have to spend, which I think I bought was like fifteen pounds, including postage. So, yeah, that's like half of it right there. Lost the blade of Jack's Knight, Queen's Knight, Skilled Dark, Dark Magician Girl. Nice. This is all. Yep, so Buster Blader stuff, and Dark Magician stuff. Because I might make a Dark Magician with Buster Blader myself. Dark Magic Curtain and Skilled Dark, and another Dark Paladin. Maybe this person bought multiple of the deck. Magnetic Field, Dark Magic Inheritance, Dark Magic Attack, Dark Magic Curtain. Soldier and Light, and another one from the structure deck. Oh no, this is a Duel's Pack one. Which is Magnet Force. That's a super rare from a Duel's Pack. Which is good because there's only like two... Duels packs. There's only like a couple supers per duels pack. Uh, this turn, all mobs on the field whose original types are machine or rock run effect by parents type monster effects. And we have some tin rares. So we have Dreamland. We have number 71 Barbarian Shark, which is really nice. We have from Mega Pack 2017 Shirinoi Solitaire. That's really good to get. Solitaire is like the one card you need from Shirinoi. And a Sun Saga. And this is all Mega Pack stuff, which is really great. We don't have Mega Pack 17 yet. We have finite cards, digital bug sent a bit. Let me just get rid of this lot. The, the Kaiju file. I want to have some Kaijus. I hate Kaijus, but I also love them because they're useful. Rise to full height, Assault Blackwing, the Rainstorm, and a Metal Force Fusion. Nice. And a Stardust Cypher Divine Dragon. If I can get more than one copy of that, that's great because I run this sort of thing. I run one in uh, Dragoonies because I don't have Quasar. Uh, Cyclone Accelerator, Canine Tour, Multi Threader, Gun Prize, Each of Millions, Pandora Story Box, Disruption Saw, uh, Cycle, Lizard Soldier, blah, 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 Covers the Ultimate Frequency, Mad Sword Beast, Fisher Race, Body Heat, Rear Round, Ruby Doom, Black Terror. I'm guessing this person had a Dinosaur deck at some point. Uh, Different Mention Gate, Shine Knight. Freak and Axis General, Changing Destiny, Goblin Elite Attack Force, Green Kappa, Kappa, <laughs> it's Kappa, uh, Mask of Darkness, The Tricky, that's a good card to get as well, uh, Minsomon of Taqua, Side Locker, and Seminated Magician, about that one. There's a lot of stuff I actually need for stats in this tin, so that's good. Um, Prideful Roar, that's another one from there, and Wing Dragon Silver, yeah. Covers the walls. Soul of Purity and Light. Acorus's Hack. Petit Moth. Hain Hain. In the Town of Soul. In the Mirica. Ooh, another card that I actually really want. Which is from Hen Nostal 3, which is a Vindicate Argenix. Which is a secret rare from Heart. So that's another really cool card. We have an MST. So nice. We have Monster Reborn, which is now unbanned, I think. It's back up to 1 again. Oh, how many formats will that last for? And a Karma Cut Bra. That's nice, because Karma Cut is a really good card. With Geki Break, Release some Stone, and another. So we have Min Master 5, Window Priestess of Gusto. Now that's cool. When this guy is for a battle by an opponent attacking monsters into your graveyard, you can special some one Gusto tuner from your deck. Which is good, because special summoning things on the deck. Or did I give her Creature Swap? That's a good generic. Miracle's Wake. Gravity Orb, Yaksha, and other Raikou. Deck stuff. Over there. Battle Fader. That's nice. Always good to get Battle Faders. Battle Faders are actually kind of expensive as well. Uh, Botanical Lion, Fighting Spirit. And we have another old card, which is funny because I already have this one. That is a nice video, the last opening. Um, we have Trap Jammer. Super rare. And a Soul Exchange from the Structure Deck. And we stick to Mato, Rogue Doll, Illusionary Gentleman, Pete in the Dark Clown, Komori, Lizard, Liz. Yeah. We have a Lord of D. Lord of D. <laughs> and a Blackwing Armed Wing from Raging Battle. And a DAD. If you don't know what DAD is, it's Dark Armed Dragon, by the way, which is from some t t Tin Promo se Series 7, number 16. That's nice. I've got the original weirdly, which is worth like 30. We have a Junk Synchron and a Junk Warrior from the Structure Deck. 
over that lot. And we have Crimson Crisis, getting all the whirlwind rare. There's a lot of... I mean, again, we've got still got... Again, just like last time, so many, like, really rare cards. What well, sort of rare? Of a rarity, okay. We have... Oh. And I think we're about... We're just over halfway through. So I think it's a good place to end the video here. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, comment, all that cool stuff. And I'll see you in the next video. It's KJXX signing off. See you guys in the next one, boys and gals and girls and family.